hello guys welcome back to another video if you are new to this channel please don't forget to subscribe all right so i needed some blocks to apply my fence wall and as at now the blocks one is selling for 7 cd 50 per space gone are the days when we used to buy three cds four cds two cd 50 per space as at now one block is selling at 7 cds 50 per space so if you need thousand four thousand five thousand you know where you are heading to yes so i needed to uplift the fence so as you can see it's, it's very short for me initially that wasn't the design though i was supposed to make a design with loggers in the middle of them but i ended up not using that design anymore because it seemed me through too much and people are passing they'll get a look of your compound even though the gates you see you see some parts is exposed that one is a bit better but for the fence wall, I just decided not to do that again. So it's very short. So I decided to lift it up. So I went to purchase about 300 pieces of blocks and I realized it was 750 per stress. It's been a long time I bought some. The last time I bought some of the blocks, it was four cities. And it's now seven cities, 50 per stress. But it's very good though, because today, right now they only do this type the one they use the quarry dust at first they were doing the the one with just the sand and the quarry dust so you decide the one you want and there's the sand that one was cheaper than the quarry dust the quarry dust type it has always been expensive you know it's always higher the price is always higher than the one with the sand but as at now they only do the one with the quarry dust they don't separate it yes i think i've been to about three block factories and i realized they are doing the same thing and it's very good because at the end of the day when you use this one for your fence so actually this one is used for building for the whole project i mean when you are building the house this is what they use so at first, people will use this one for the house and they will use the sand one for their fence wall. Which is not a good advice because at the end of the day, when you use this one, I think my fence wall, it has been there for almost a year now. I've not done plastering, but you can see it's still intact. Not like the one with the sand. If it's there without plastering, you see the stones will end up breaking down gradually gradually will end up breaking down but when you use this type it's very strong even though you've not done your plastering yes so i think this one is way better because i've been to someone's site and the person used only the sand that type the old one and you can see when he's ready to um i mean continue his project he would have to change all the blocks for the fence wall because they are very weak as at now they are very weak due to rainfall and other you know so all the stones he used for the fence wall are very weak not like my own i used from the beginning i used the corridor type so it's still intact yes yeah, so this is what they are doing now you see they are lifting it up and i think it's better when you are inside when you are on the compound it looks very okay but when you are outside it's very high yes but when you are on the compound it's, it's a bit normal and okay but when you go outside it's very very high that's what i'm doing now and you can compare the difference how it used to be initially this is what i intended to leave it but i realized it was way down it was very very down so I talked to the guys and they knew how they'll go about it. I showed them how I wanted it and the level which it will be. So they decided to raise it up for me. A bit, not that much, but per the calculation, I think 300 blocks was enough. And you can see how they are doing it. And as at now, it's very high. When you are on the compound, it's okay, but at the back there. So I think they used about about three days yes about three days they only came to do the uplifting for now 
later on they'll come and do the plastering and all that necessary thing and also now as that's now the mason and the laborers the mason charges 150 cities per day and the laborer also takes 120 cities yes the last time i was using them that is about a year ago it was i think it was about 100 cities for mason and 80 for labor but as that's now labor is 120 cities and mason is 150 cities yes so most of the jobs on your site for instance when they are coming to do something like the plastering if you are to pay them by day it will cost you it will cost you it's rather you sit them down and you ask them how much they will take for the whole thing how much they will take i think that one you can you know bit around the bush and try and let them reduce it because when they are doing it for by day that one there's nothing like reduction this is the price this is the fixed amount yes and for something like the blocks for the by day it is 100 blocks they're supposed to do 100 blocks after the 100 blocks that's all they are done for the day so even if they come in the morning and by let's say 12 or maybe after five hours they are done with their 100 blocks they are done but if you give it to them like in a contract way that one they will go higher and also be very fast because mind you the longer they spend on the work the higher their money so if something that they are supposed to use maybe three days or maybe two days because is by day they will end up using five days that is it that's their way of also making high money yes so if you give it to them as contract that one they want to do it very fast and also go and get another work they can't waste much time on one project so the contract is some way somehow for instance this one it wasn't any work uh -huh, it wasn't that much work so i paid them by day but when they started the whole fence war, that one was a contract. And they also did the plastering of the main building also. That one was a contract. But this one was something small. It wasn't that any work. So they ended up doing it by the end. It was, I think, three days. Three days. So it's 100 blocks um, per day. Yes. So they completed it. And now we are going to move to the next one. Yes, I have to let them come and do all the necessary um, wall light and, you know, every electrical work they will do on the wall before the stone layer comes and starts its work. So that is all for this video. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe if you are new to this channel. See you in the next video. Bye-bye.